A new study at WSU Spokane hopes to prove that getting enough good sleep can help treat chronic pain, which plagues millions of Americans. And it might also impact the world. Opiate crisis problem nationwide. KXY Force Caroline, we're working for you. Caroline? We already know that sleep impacts our physical and mental health because a lot of the time we know what it feels like when we don't get enough of it. If this study can prove that good sleep can help chronic pain, it might lessen our reliance on painkillers, stopping many cases of opiate addiction before they start. For many heroin or opioid, opioid addicts, drug use begins with a doctor's prescription. Opioid painkillers are the go-to response for surgeries, injuries, and even chronic pain. But do they have to be? What if something as simple as a good night's sleep could ease chronic pain and also decrease our national dependence on serious painkillers? That's what the study at WSU Spokane hopes to find out. Participants will be given a wristband. It'll track how much and how well they sleep. Over the course of two years, the folks at the WSU Sleep Lab will collect and compare that data with information about their pain levels. A national opiate epidemic has put increased pressure on physicians to prescribe fewer painkillers and find better alternatives. We really need to get these options out to people. We need to understand more about how they work and understand how to teach people to adopt new habits. If the study proves successful, Dr. Wilson hopes we'll be able to reach a point where opioid painkillers become an, if all else fails, option for patients. Now, the study at WSU Spokane is actually part of a bigger study being conducted by the University of Washington and the VA Puget Sound Healthcare System. Veterans with chronic pain are being taught alternative ways to manage their symptoms, including self-hypnosis and mindfulness meditation. In studio, Caroline Rourke, KXY4 News. Mm -hmm.